Well, a lot of frustration leads to finally a fix in a dangerous I-65 bridge detour. 48 hours after the Boone County Sheriff vented on Facebook after two deadly accidents on the route, a traffic light finally goes up at one of the worst intersections. Eyewitness News reporter David McAnally on why some say this should have been done a long time ago. This, plus a fatal wreck this week, drove INDOT to do this. Remove the old blinking yellow caution lights for US 52 and replace them with new stop and go lights at the busy 52 State Road 47 intersection. It's been kind of crazy. Traffic is way up here. 52 is the detour going around the closed I-65 bridge in Lafayette. It's a lot of interstate traffic, a lot of commerce. Uh, local citizens uh, have to deal with this. The school buses have to deal with this. Police had ticketed some drivers for speeds up to 90 miles per hour on this stretch, and others make dangerous dashes to cross 52. It's got so bad the Boone County Sheriff pleaded on Facebook with INDOT to do something. It's been even more dangerous, so I know that it's probably about time that they do something. With everybody getting hurt like the way they are, there's two accidents in the past week. I mean, I feel like it does help a lot. Will the lights work? Well, where they did this in Clinton County last week, traffic watcher Larry Funk says... There was a considerable backup there uh, before they done that, but people are a little bit impatient. That SUV, state police, is pacing the traffic to slowly approach the intersection where construction's happening. There will be some intermittent single lane uh, closures, 10 p.m., at which point we may have to do a short shutdown of the entire uh, route to hang support cables. They were hoping to have them operational about midnight. David McAnally, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.